a dozen crossing guards said goodbye to a hit and run victim. Shauna Arredondo worked as a crossing guard until her death. Action Center reporter Matt Howerton joins us live from Chelwood Park in Copper, where that crash happened. He was at tonight's memorial. Yeah, Doug, when you take a look at this memorial here on the corner of Copper and Shellwood Park, it's clear how many lives Shauna Arredondo touched. Heartbreak consumed her funeral service tonight, but when all was said and done, many told us this loving mother got the farewell of a lifetime. They are pictures that paint a story. And I know we are all so crushed right now. And that doesn't make sense. Of a life taken too soon. Shauna, I love you. And I will never be the same without you and Shaylee. Pews were packed at First Christian Church tonight, where hundreds showed up to say goodbye to Shauna Arendando. And thank you for showing her family just how much she meant to all of us. In January, Arredondo, 39, was driving with her 14-year-old daughter, Shaylee Bowling, and her 3-year-old son. Investigators say a stolen van crashed into their car. Two suspects took off from the scene and were later arrested and charged with two counts of murder. Shaylee died in the crash. Shauna recently died at the hospital. They tried so very hard to save her. Shaylee had come for Shauna. And Shauna was no longer suffering. Shauna was beloved by many. She was a crossing guard at John Baker Elementary. Guards from other schools even attended the funeral tonight. Loved ones shared their favorite stories of Arredondo. Her husband says they were married in the very church where tonight's memorial was held. I lost my soulmate. She still has the key to my heart. And I have hers. Yeah, I'm never going to let ever let that go. Tears were shed. Hugs were shared. But the memory of this mom and her daughter lives on. And those suspects charged with murder are Alexis Groves and Paul Garcia. They'll be in court to be arraigned this Friday. In Albuquerque, Matt Howerton, KOAT, Action 7 News.